This day with God, March 8, what love does. While I live, will I praise the Lord. I will sing praises unto my God while I have any being. Psalms 146, verse 2. For half a century, I have been the Lord's messenger. And as long as my life shall last, I shall continue to bear the messages that God gives me for his people. I take no glory to myself. In my youth, the Lord made me his messenger to communicate to his people testimonies of encouragement, warning, and reproof. For 60 years, I have been in communication with heavenly messengers, and I have been constantly learning in reference to divine things and in reference to the way in which God is constantly working to bring souls from the error of their ways to the light in God's light. I love God. I love Jesus Christ, the Son of God, and I feel an intense interest in every soul who claims to be a child of God. I am determined to be a faithful steward so long as the Lord shall spare my life. I will not fail nor be discouraged. But for months my soul has been passing through intense agony on account of those who have received the sophistries of Satan and are communicating the same to others, making every conceivable interpretation in various ways to destroy confidence in the gospel messages. For this last generation and in the special work which God has given me to do I know that the Lord has given me this work and I have no excuse to make for what I have done in my experience I am constantly receiving evidence of the sustaining miracle working power of God upon my body and my soul which I have dedicated to the Lord I am not my own I have been bought with a price and I have such assurance of the Lord's working in my behalf that I must acknowledge his abundant grace. I love the Lord. I love my Savior and my life is holy in the hands of God. As long as he sustains me, I shall bear a decided testimony. Why should I complain? So many times has the Lord raised me from my sickness. So wonderfully has he sustained me that I can never doubt. I have so many unmistakable evidences of his special blessings that I could not possibly doubt. He gives me freedom to speak. Is truth before the large numbers of people. 